How's it going everybody? Tommy Star here. Thank you for clicking on this video. And happy Movie Tuesday. Um, I wasn't really going to do a shopping video today, even though there is one big title that I wanted to pick up. The uh, newest installment in the DC Animated Universe. Uh, so definitely excited to check that out. There should be some exclusives of that, I believe. Um, but otherwise, there are some other cool things that came out today. Um, we got some brand new uh, Deadpool photobomb slipcovers at Walmart. I think they, uh, I think there's like six more that came out today. Um, we have a, uh, let's see, Mac and Me came to Blu-ray for the first time today um, from Shout Factory. But, of course, won't be in store. I got it pre-ordered, but uh, definitely a childhood favorite of mine. But otherwise, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, huh, how can I forget? Predator comes to 4K today. Yes. Uh, there's supposed to be an individual release of the first one, and then there's supposed to be a three-pack of all of them. Um, all 4K. And then there was also supposed to be a steelbook that came out today for Predator. I don't think that it's a 4K steelbook. I think it's a Blu-ray steelbook, and I don't think it's exclusive to anywhere. Um, and I think it just might be, you know, I think you should be able to find it anywhere. I don't think it's, like, exclusive to Best Buy, but I think Best Buy might be the only one that has it if it is out in stores. So, anyways, so, yeah, we probably won't go to, go to a lot of places today. I'm by myself. Uh, I just want to check out a couple of those titles and uh, see what else we might be able to find today. So, we will see you at the first location. All right. We are at the first location, the Shizzle by Nizzle. If you guys remember from my last week's video, my particular Best Buy has officially joined all the other Best Buys who are completely phasing out their movies. So sad. So they moved their new release section over to more to the front of the store, so let's see what we got here. This must have been fairly new. I don't know if this is this week. You know, season four of Star Wars Rebels. It's 38, 32 for the DVD. Next week, baby. <laughs> yes. Gotta check the other side. There's nothing over there. Okay, so here's the big release of the week for me. The Death of Superman. Newest installment for the DC Animated Universe. So they got the blue at 18. And then they have, they have this... Uh, box set thing that I think you get a hardcover graphic novel in here. That's 23. That's kind of cool. And then they also have another exclusive for 28. You get a Superman figurine with it. Oh, got it. Get that back in there. I think it's going to happen. Oh, we got it. And then they do have a 4K, which is 28. So... And then, as far as other stuff, I guess that, yeah, this was new this week. This new Willis McCarthy film, Life of the Party. I don't really know much about that one, but I know that came out today, so it seems to be about it. Not seeing any of the Predator movies. Maybe they're in a different section. Let's go take a look. A couple of things in here that appear to be new. This uh, Marrowbone with uh, Charlie Heaton from Stranger Things. Got a 4K for 18 and a Blu-ray for 13, it looks like. I don't know anything about that. And we got this Revenge. 15 bucks on Blu-ray. That looks to be new. Um, breaking in. 20. Don't know anything about that. Um, that looks to be really about it. I don't know where the Predator stuff is. I guess I have to keep looking. Found Predator. So here's their collection of all three movies. Cool art. That is 47. And then here's the individual release with the slip. Definitely badass looking. And that is 30. So for 18 more, you can get all set. Is this new? Complete set of Harry Potter in 14. I thought that came out a while back. And this one, they got this Land Before Time 30th Anniversary playset thing for a DVD, it looks like, for 15. I don't know. I haven't seen that, that might be new. 
Um, still not seeing that one still book I was talking about for Predator. Let's keep looking back up. They brought this all the way down to like 140. Now they put it back up to 250. <laughs> I bet some people might be a little pissed they missed out on that. <laughs> okay, we are out of Best Buy. Got one item in there. Um, I guess uh, I thought there was a steel book for um, Death of Superman. That may be over at Target. Don't know if I'm going to stop there. I guess we'll find out. But not really much else to choose from today. And that Predator steel book I was telling you about, I don't know where that is. It's not really on Best Buy's website, um, so I don't know. Guess we'll have to keep checking. So we will see you over at the next okay, location. Okay, we are over at Target. I figured I'd just stop here because uh, I want to see that still book because apparently it is Target that has it. So I just wanted to double check, see what it looks like. section and I think they have oh so it's a 4k still book that's kind of cool it's 30 for the 4k still book oh and they do have a blu-ray one too okay it looks like the same art so 30 for the 4k still book 20 for the blu-ray still book and they do have Party, same price. It's breaking in that they had a Best Buy. It's like a little bit more here, 23. Um, I think that's it. This Measure of a Man, Donald Sutherland, Luke Wilson. DVD for 13, and then this on Chesil Beach. I don't know what that is, but it looks new. So they're like toys and pops and whatnot. NECA is supposedly making its way to Target. And I've heard that some people have seen them already, but I've yet to see any in any of my targets. But NECA, I mean, it looks kind of empty over here, so maybe they're planning something. I don't know if it's going to be here or by the actual toys. I don't know, but one day. Okay, we're out of Target. Kind of lame in there. I didn't see any predators. Um, of course, didn't see that still book I was looking for for Predator, but at least we got to see the Death of Superman still books. I didn't know it was 4K and Blu ray. That's kind of cool. But anyway, yeah, nothing in there. I guess we'll see you at the next way location. Over to Wally World. So we'll get in there and see if they have any Death of Superman exclusives. All right, so I'm looking at their thing up front, and I'm not seeing the dead pool slips, which they're supposed to be here. Old new releases. And here's their main release section, and then they do have a Predator over here. There's the new... Um, Blu-ray release of it, and then the DVD. Um, actually, don't see any keys to deal with that. Huh? Yeah, but no Deadpool. I don't know. Guess I'll check the back. Okay, well, this is badass. We got this whole display thing, advertising. You know, and Deadpool 2 comes in you know, Blu-ray and 4K on August 21st, which is you know like two weeks, but. And they also brought in a lot of their other ones back. They only got like a lot of the old ones that they had and all the new ones now. City Slickers. These are just too cool, you guys. Check out this alien one. That is awesome. And we got the Martian. <laughs> 127 hours. Devil Wears Prada. Day after tomorrow. <laughs> That's great. Love it. <laughs> and for those who might not have seen the old ones, here's what all the old ones look like. And then you got this. And you 
can watch it now. You can buy it through Voodoo and watch it already. That's cool. 20 bucks to get that. Here's a two cool little this whole display that they got going on. Awesome. It's over by there in the release section here. It looks like they got the same thing that uh, Best Buy has. So it's to be a little bit cheaper here. Yeah. 4K looks a little bit cheaper here. And then, um, this is a different cover, I thought. I thought the one I bought at Best Buy was a different cover, I don't know. But this seems to be about the same price for the Blu ray. What's this down here? Oh. Check those out, you guys. I have a three movie collection still for Predator. Ooh, that's badass. Oh, never expected Walmart to have something like that. That is cool. Oh, I might have to get up on that. Sweet. That's 20. We oh, got this. Beast Legends. I don't know what that is. That looks to be for this week. And of course, Life of the Par Life of the Party. Same price here. Good Doctor Season 1. I don't know if that's new. This HBO series here and now. That might be new this week. Doubt it now. We got some more slipcovers. This is pretty cool. They got one for E.T. That is just badass looking. Maybe they got a Lucy one. But it's like, look at this. They got Army of Darkness. Um, Legend down there. Waterworld. They're all fucking DVDs. Why do they do that? Then they got these up here. But the only ones that they have that are Blu-ray are the Incredible Hulk. Which obviously I have a slip for. And then Scarface. Um, but like this one. Like, I would love to have this because mine doesn't have a slip. This is the 2003 Hulk. But only DVD. What the hell? That's stupid. But these are like those, uh, remember they made that whole Steelbook line. They called the Real Hero. And now they're releasing slip covers of them. It's crazy. Oh, he's just can't get them back in. Oh shit. But yeah, I mean they're badass looking, but why are they just DVDs? I don't get it. Oh, being the first Tuesday of the month, of course they got a bunch of these new movies. This one here, I was <laughs> I remember actually being interested in this, but it's like they only have a DVD of that. This is supposed to be just absolutely insane, this house shark. Um, see what else we got here. A lot of these look new. Dead Shack. Looks, this looks new this week from, they have released this. You can't even really tell. Dead Shack. Oh, this looks kind of cool. This came out, I believe. Pie Wacket, whatever that is. Let's see the aura. Black Wake. Can't remember which ones these are new, which ones aren't. Toxic Shark. Big Legend. Mandy the Hunted Doll. House of Salem. Yeah. A lot of these look new. This one actually looks kind of cool, though. Okay, Walmart's got some different kind of stuff today. All right, we are out of Walmart. Surprisingly, Walmart has some cool stuff today, but got a couple things here, some goodies. Um, so yeah, like I said, really surprised with uh, with what Walmart uh, had in there today, some cool stuff. So anyway, I think I might go hit up one more spot. 
Um, not really quite sure. I guess we'll we'll see when I get there. Last location of the day, Chibo. The expensive low. Hard to get footage in this store because they're always blasting music, but hopefully they won't be able to try. You find something good every once in a while, but it's like like this, for example. Just named a Blu-ray. You'll never find that in store anywhere. You want, what, 22 for that? But, I don't know, we'll just look around here and see if we can find anything cool. See, you know, they do sell like Sheldon Stream Factory, 23 for that. Every once in a while though, you do find something pretty decent. All right, we're out of Cheapo and <laughs> actually found a couple things in there surprisingly. Like I said, you never know. All right. All right, that'll wrap it up for this week's shopping video. Pretty happy with what I found today. So uh, let's take a look at the pickups for the week. All right, so we'll go ahead and take a look at what I picked up over at Walmart. Um, so, Chronicles of Narnia, The Voyage of the Dawn Treader. Treader? Treader? Um, anyway, uh, this was another one of those uh, Fox slipcovers, like the big and the um, Miss Doubtfire and whatnot. I picked this up because um, I just recently found uh, Lion, Witch, in the Wardrobe, and I'm working on getting um, Prince Caspian. And this is the only one in the trilogy i think there's only three that isn't disney but i knew that walmart had the you know it's a bad glare i'm sorry i know walmart had the uh the hell there you go <laughs> had this cool new slipcover edition so i had to pick that up and then of course because i'm crazy i had to get up on these you guys <laughs> the new uh, deadpool slipcovers day after tomorrow um, Devil Wears Prada 127 hours I love these things man you know me and Deadpool I like to collect everything Deadpool this one's badass City Slickers this is an MGM title all the other ones are Fox it's weird oh I guess MGM and Fox I don't know City Slickers Couple more here. This one. Alien. Oh my god, you guys, that is just badass. So cool. Got all six, of course, I had to. I, I got all the other ones last time. I think last time there was like 16. Now there's only six, but then the Martian. Alright, so that's everything from uh yeah, Walmart. All right, I was getting such a bad glare, just decided to go home and finish it in the driveway. So, continuing on. Cheapo. Yeah, I found some good titles over there. One that's been on the list for a while. Uh, it was in their uh, new arrival section. That is jo Joyride 3 Roadkill. I think these, these movies are a lot of fun. Obviously, the first one is the best, kicks ass, but I really love the kills in the, in the sequels. This is one of those series of movies that are just stupid because one in three is on Blu-ray, but two isn't. Yeah, I don't know, but five bucks over there at Cheapo. And the other one, which is falling down the side here. A movie that came out like a month or two ago, and it was something that I wanted to get, um, but it was like 20 bucks. I didn't want to spend 20 bucks on it, but I heard it was actually a really cool movie, and that is Den of Thieves. They had it over there at Cheapo for $10 with the slipcover. Figured, hey, for $10, bucks, i will grab it. So, like I said, it looks really cool. Uh, if you guys want to read about this, it just sounds like a badass movie. So, now that's what I got over at Cheapo. Let's take a look at Best Buy. All right, now the big release of the week, Death of Superman. Newest installment in the DC Animated Universe. Uh, as you guys know, I got that big, huge box set of, of every one of these with the Every time a new one comes out now, I just get the subcover edition. So this one looks pretty badass. I'm excited to watch this one. Um, and some cool uh, exclusives for this. Looks like they had like four different exclusives if you count the two different still books. So kick ass. Not a bad haul for the week. Gotta love those uh, Deadpool subcovers. I had to get up on every one of those. So hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Just hit that like button right down below. Drop me a comment. Let me know what you guys picked up this week. 
Uh, share the video around, subscribe if you have not, and don't forget to hit that notification bell so you guys are always notified every time I upload a video. Thank you so much for watching. We will see you guys next time. Bye.